Another brave soul for our ranks. Welcome aboard. I'm ready to stir up the shit with you. Fucking excellent. Been monitoring the drone network. Mary Kelly has finally sent out the invitations to her slave market sale. Dadzek, it's Caitlin Lau. This is your specialty. Hack one of those drones and get the location where she's selling those poor microchipped people. Let's put an end to this. simple, even for you. Give me a moment to decipher the security codes. So, Bagley, what do you have? Mary Kelly is holding her sale at Hackney Baths. Opened in 1904, it was, as the name implies, a public sanitation facility. In today's more enlightened modern times, it's a slave trading market. She mentioned foreign investors, so this is big. It means associates, clients, employees, anyone remotely involved in her organization. We're taking Mary Kelly down from within. Inspector Lau wants to take her case against Mary Kelly to a contact in the Attorney General's office, which means gathering as much data as we can to make sure it has the leverage needed for them to prosecute. The microchips are a huge part of this equation that we know almost nothing about. We need something tangible about these things. See if you can find anything. Blueprints, receipts, samples. So, the plan is simple. Crash the Kelly's soiree, find out as much as you can, and, minor detail, try not to get killed. Can't be too careful at the bath team. Mary can kill all her captives with the push of a button. If we try to free them now, they're good as dead. She doesn't know we're on to her yet. That gives us the advantage. What do we do now? Don't just blunder in. Hack the building CTOS hub and see what to expect once you're inside. Good plan. I'm inside. Get all the names, places, dates, whatever information you can in there. We need to build this case and find a way to free those people. I will try to find out something. Aye, no one's here yet. Good thing, too. The champagne's late. And you know how these rich bastards are like free Blanc. We end up the team with it. Yeah, products primed and ready for sale. No worries. Nah, she ain't. Not for this lot, at least. Which is fine with me. She's the boss and all, but... Uh, Exactly. <laughs> Always on eggshells when she's around. Oh, bound to be bloody too. Come on, look at the camera. Straight. Right, that's good. Stand up now. And slowly turn around. I, I don't want to do this. Please. Get your fucking ass up. Fucking miserable. There's no way this bastard will sell. The buyers expect high quality stuff. All right, then. Get him downstairs. We'll update the catalogue and put his stats no, online. No, I, I'm sorry. I'll do what you say. <gasps> don't take me there. No. Shut the fuck up. Shit! What the fuck? Let's take a look-see then. 
Chances are good the basement will be locked. Chances are equally good that one of these knobheads left their access codes laying around somewhere. Thanks for the cellar key, knobhead. Fantastic. These rich people are drinking cocktails and buying slaves. Ugh, makes me want to vomit. That or kill them all. Keep your head. If we try anything before disabling the microchips, Mary Kelly is liable to purge her inventory. Well, there it is. The Golden Goose. 
Mary Kelly set up a fucking online marketplace for everything bad. Human traffic, black market organs, guns. I suggest washing your hands after this. Well, here's something interesting. Miss Kelly, why is our explosive shipment today? You've received the crypto. Every penny, love. Must admit, I thought you were some trolls chatting shit in Mum's basement. And what do you think now? I think you're well funded. And my organization could be implicated in something quite ghastly. I think the price just doubled. True to your reputation. But we can offer you something more valuable than money. <laughs> What's that then? Power. We can make you the Queen of London. Queen, eh? A queen is sovereign, autonomous. Unchecked. Release our shipment, and London will be yours to rule. Well, I know a good deal when I hear one. Fireworks are on the way. Careful you don't burn yourselves now. Uh, this is the nail in her coffin. Mary Kelly supplied the explosives for the bombings. Add that to the slaves and the organ market. She is done. That's an interesting turn of events. So Mary isn't Zero Day, but she's involved. I have to admit, Zero Day's plan to cover their tracks was clever, and it worked. Even I didn't suspect this, and I suspect a lot of things. Let's not lose sight of what we're doing here. We need everything on the Golden Goose for Caitlin's case. Bagley, were you able to recover any data? This is a simple market site. I've recovered inventory lists, but not much that will help Inspector Lau's case. Bags. We need to find a website service. We can siphon the information Caitlin needs and shut this down before it goes fully online. I'd love to, but the servers are rudely jumping all over the world. They're probably using a shuffle protocol or some kind of mix net. I can work it out, obviously, but it will take me a few days. The guy upstairs are welcomed everyone seems to be running the show. Might save us some time. I received it, yes, but it's not what I asked for. I'm sorry you haven't enjoyed our product, ma'am. Now, with our 10-day satisfaction policy, we can provide you with a replacement within a few days. Okay, cut the customer service crap. The request I submitted was very detailed. I specifically asked for 10 years of age. This one is older. I want a refund, and I'll just take my business elsewhere. Ma'am, we tried to accommodate your order to the best of our abilities, but we are experiencing a supply shortage. Let me send you one of our younger models, free of charge. See if it suits you. No, no. Pubescent doesn't cut it. The person I was in contact with guaranteed that the ages were thoroughly checked before shipment. This is an outright scam. The network will hear about this.
good instincts. I've got coordinates for the Golden Goose servers, and as a bonus, the microchip control relay. Both are at NeoGate. That is good work, Bugley. And another one. Dead sec. We need that server data. Once we have it, I'll take it to the Attorney General's office. Mary Kelly is going down for all of this. I think we should break the servers and the microchip control thing before we do that. People go free, we get to fuck shit up. Everybody's happy. Next stop, NeoGate. It seems Mary hit the Golden Goose service in the heart of a cybersecurity software company. I don't condone her actions, but I must applaud the method. I've found a potential recruit for you. Drop in a pin on your map. Okay, I'm here. Neogate hasn't been around for long, but they're leading the antivirus market. I bet the Kellys have something to do with this growing success. Regardless, we're about to destroy all of it. Listen, I want that as bad as you do, but let's gather all the evidence we can before blowing it up. This is what we've been chasing after this whole time. I suggest hacking the camera network to see what's what.
These feeds are from a sub-basement under the server room. Anyone up for some light entertainment? You see, it contains a chemical cocktail. Botulinum, conotoxin, succinicholine. Well, why go with the specifics if you wouldn't even understand? Let's just say it took a lot of trial and error to get the mix right. Wouldn't want the killing too quickly or contaminating the organs. Oh my god, this is where they implant the microchips. Test them. Bagley, capture all this footage. It's all going into my case file. Here's another. I'm glad to see they're trying to keep things sterile. Don't want to risk infection. One more. At issue are the strong convulsions triggered by the microchips and concern over the possibility of damaging the valuable merchandise, the eyes being the most vulnerable. Initial findings indicate that the microcharge may be the problem. Although the damage to the lower stem is minimal, it is enough to trigger strong convulsions in approximately okay, Bagley, 34 cases. Okay, that's enough. Let's do something about this. There's a special place in hell for all the people involved in this operation. You've got all the Golden Goose data along with this footage. Plus, you have her conspiring in the bombings. That must be enough to put Mary away. I hope so. Now, how about blowing that shit up and disabling those microchips? Fuck yes. It's open. Congratulations on your great victory. Now I'm feeling dead sick. Time to put Mary Kelly's operation on ice. Let's blow some shit up. This should do it. The 
no longer functioning. I think Kenny's golden goose is cooked. Just leave the area before the station thing happens to you. All right. You're just gonna have a funny ride. Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. We have enough, DedSec. I'm going to my contact in the Attorney General's office right now. No time to waste. Mary Kelly is finally going down. Thanks. Don't let us down, Caitlin. And what about the people with the chips? We can't leave them under Clan Kelly's control. Any second now, Mary Kelly is going to realize that her personal slaves are no longer slaves and more like potential witnesses. We should apprehend her before she turns them into definite corpses. We can't risk that happening. It might throw a spanner in Caitlin's plans. But we need to help those last few people she's threatening. The Kelly's stronghold is at the Sandstone residence. I've marked it on your map. 